is Kevin Mayo, and today we're going to drink some Dogfish Head American Beauty. This is a limited release beer. It's an homage to the Grateful Dead. It has granola in it. It's an Imperial Pale Ale, 9% ABV, 55 IBUs, and that's all we really know about it. We do have a new bottle opener today. A friend of mine went out to Sierra Nevada and brought me back a Sierra Nevada bottle opener, so thank you, John. Go ahead and give it a crack. Haven't done too many reviews lately, been busy with a bunch of other stuff, but we're back on the horse now. Let's go ahead and we'll give this a pour. As always, if you like the reviews, please subscribe. We're always looking for new friends. And go ahead and leave some comments. Well, not an overly aggressive pour, but we've got quite a bit of head on it. Probably got about yeah, three fingers worth of head on it. Not overly carbonated, fairly clear, dark orange in color. Not sure if we can see it here, probably not. Very tight head, and the head's probably tan. Let's do some aroma. Smell like orange. And then I smell, I mean, they always say, oh, I smell bread or I smell toasty, but I think I smell the granola. It's, it's got a different, a different aroma to it. You, you can smell it like, yeah, it smells like granola. And then just a hint, a hint of more citrusy. I heard they said the orange, but say probably more grapefruit. And then way underneath, I just got a whiff of the alcohol, like my third time through. I have let this warm up, so it should be at an optimal temperature. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. Wow. Oof. It's nice, nice malt profile. You can just taste that caramel, toffee, bready. And then you get a nice kick of bitter at the end. Not in your face bitter, not, not that we're going to really, you know, we're not hopping it up, we're not ramping it up, we're not bitter for bitter sake but we're taking off that sweetness from the mall, just the way a beer should be. And, and it's got a very, it's almost like a creamy mouthfeel. Not like a stout, but you don't get that astringent, acidic stuff that you get a lot of times from the Imperial IPAs. It, it's a little smoother in the middle. I think that this one needs to age. I can definitely taste the alcohol. Doesn't burn, but say compared to a um, Dogfish at 90, which is 9% alcohol also, I can actually taste the alcohol in this one, where I don't in the, in the 90. Smooth, nice small profile, a little bit bitter kick. Uh, I said I smelled the orange. I don't really so much taste it. It's just kind of a hint of like orange juice, just like a bit of sweetness in the middle of it. Uh, can't say that I taste the granola really. Uh, I know that Sam in the video says he could taste it. I'm not picking up the granola. I think this beer definitely buy it and store it. I think this one is definitely one that will round out as it ages. Overall, I think it's a very, very, very good beer. Um, it's not knocking my socks off, and I think because it's still too new. I'm going to give it 78 out of 100. Interesting experiment, worth trying. Let me know if you guys try it, what you think. Uh, but I think it really needs to age. Till next time, keep drinking.